Hi guys, George from Cyprus Insight and today we're looking at the Excalibur Hotel in Las Vegas. So here we are in the Excalibur Royal Tower and we're showing you around the room guys. There's a massive bathroom, look at that shower, isn't it massive, enormous and you get the toilet trees. There we are. Oh, lovely fluffy towels. Oh, there's even a hair dryer. Look. And let's go round now. There's your cupboard with your safe. Massive beds. Look at that. And there's two of them. There we are. They're very comfortable, by the way. And little lights on the side and lights around the bed look and then we've got a desk here we are I've got some more bits and pieces on the desk okay. it's outside oh also guys we've got a lamp and this lovely corner suite how about that and there's a big tv and lots of drawers and this enormous mirror there we are, the size of that. Amazing. Here's the view, look, from my window. And you can see the Luxor Hotel. You can see it's like a pyramid. Okay guys, we're outside the room at the Excalibur and we're going to go down the lift, there we are, and we'll wander around and see what there is. Going down, there we are, out towards the casino and now on my right is the exit, we'll go outside for a little bit. There we are. Yes, it's uh, very noisy. There we are. Right, we're outside, guys. And being Las Vegas, it is very noisy. Now, there's the Mandalay Bay. Look, massive hotels everywhere. Can you see? And there's a monorail here that will take you to some of the other hotels like Mandalay Bay and the Pyramid Hotel, Luxor. There's the main road guys. There we are, MGM there. Great big high rise buildings. That's the Tropicana over there. Now these uh, hotels have got uh, thousands of rooms. Look, there's Excalibur from the outside. You can see, look how big it is. That's one section. And then there's another one over here. Thousands of rooms, guys. Now I'll take you back inside and we'll have a walk through towards reception. And normally it's nice and quiet in reception you can relax but uh, not here guys a total different atmosphere it's like you're in a city right so there was the lifts a coffee shop straight outside the lift And then as you go towards reception, being Las Vegas, we've got the casino, the massive casino. Johnny Rockets on our left. Hamburgers and fries and what have you. There we are, that's Johnny Rockets for you. 
what we do, we'll go through the casino, right in the middle. There we are. What we've got on our left, a great big bar, Sherwood Forest Bar. There we are. And all the bars, guys, have got gambling machines right where you can sit there and there's the seat you see so you can order a drink and gamble at the same time right so here's the reception and we're used to uh, comfortable seats nice and quiet but no guys this is Las Vegas and you have to queue up to check in. There we are. And if it's a weekend, guys, this is a long queue here. And that, you can queue up. There's another bar, again, with uh, gambling machines next to each stall. All right, there's another exit on my right just past reception we'll go out of there exit and have a look what's around there we are. oh there's the bell desk very different from what we used to in Cyprus There's a great big ice cream parlour right near the exit, guys. Mmm, look at that. Looks really delish. Right, let's go outside. There she are. Look at those windows, aren't they marvellous? We have been to one other hotel here guys and videoed it look out for the video right so this is just the uh, pickup point if I go to the left I could show you uh, New York New York let's just go past the taxi pickup point around this area here and if I go beyond this taxi here, we could get a good view of New York. There it is. There's New York. There we are, the Empire State Building. Now, all these buildings, guys, is part of one hotel. An enormous hotel. It's even got a roller coaster going round. You see? There's the Statue of Liberty between the trees. We might have to turn around, we might be able to see the Excalibur again. There we are. There's the Excalibur Hotel from the front. Very impressive. Right, let's go back into the hotel and casino. There we are. Lovely and cool. Lots of air conditioning going on. Uh, we'll go this side, I think, guys, on the right. So we'll do a whole circle around the premises. Look at the top, look. convenience store that's handy what we've got here on the right Dick's last resort a theme restaurant guys there we are there we are There's a the theme restaurant there. 
very popular what we've got next to it so another bar look that oh that's attached to the uh, restaurant guys it's quite a big bar looks like someone's won something on the fruit machine there we go right more restaurants what does that do oh wraps mexicans food so what i'll do guys i'll take you around the pool area and show you the pool and then we'll head back towards our escalators now this is the other building we don't want these escalators we're right on the other end right guys the pool's not open yet opens at 10 o'clock but you can see the pool area there we are they've got three pools here with just some beds all the way round And there's lifeguards all around the pool area guys there's two lifeguards per pool i'll take you around here the back of the uh, gift shop so you can see the pool area can you see so there's three pools and it can get quite busy morning looks like uh, you can buy some bits and pieces for swimming so if you forgot your swimming stuff it's handy and there's security thank you so guys uh, if you're coming from outside you can't use the pool you've got to have your room key and security will check that and you go for straight into the pool now once you've been swimming guys it is very strange because if you're on the other side of the hotel the other big building you have to make your way through the casino to get to the lifts and back to the room seems very strange but there you are it's not too bad place has got carpet right through and I have been swimming a couple of times guys and just uh, strolled through this area with uh, bare feet not a problem at all feels a bit strange but uh, there you go that's Las Vegas for you right another bar and lounge oh this is a sports lounge guys they've got great big uh, screens up you can watch some sports there's a cashier if you've won a ton of money you can pick up your money and these are MGM Resort Rewards Oh, there's a Starbucks in here look at that now straight ahead guys is a sports book what they call sports book I suppose we call it a betting office an extremely large betting office there it is they show all the sports on these massive screens and there's the uh, comfortable seats you can watch all the sports that you're betting on and as you're doing that you could always grab yourself a little drink at this sports bar you see looks like they're 
playing American football on there at the moment. So the place is vast, isn't it? Enormous. What we got here? Another restaurant, guys. We have eaten there. It's very delish. They've got uh, burgers and chicken burgers. Their speciality, I do believe, was the chicken burger. Right. Back round, there's lobby straight ahead of us where we come from. And we're going to go down back towards our lift, guys. The Royal Tower. There's signs everywhere. You can get lost a bit, but not uh, for too long. So there are signs. Look, that's the Uber pickup. Uh, if you ordered an Uber, you can pick that up down there. Right, so we're going to say night night to our night. So I hope you enjoyed that visit to the extremely large Excalibur Hotel. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if there's somewhere you'd like me to go, put it in the comments below.